I'm a big fan of Resident Evil. Um, I'm a big fan of the original Resident Evil. I love Resident Evil 1, Resident Evil 2. Uh, Nemesis is alright. I love Resident Evil Code Veronica on my Dreamcast. Uh, Resident Evil 4 was a phenomenon that was one of the pivotal moments in gaming for me. Resident Evil 5 was alright. I say alright because I played with my wife and Resident Evil 6 was dog shit. I like Resident Evil Revelations on the 3DS. You know, I thought that was a great game. And I'm kind of anxiously anticipating what this Resident Evil Revelations 2 is going to be like as it's in uh, Episodic Adventure. Now, Resident Evil the remake that was released January 20th has broken all kinds of crazy sales records. And uh, it's Capcom's biggest selling digital game of all time. Uh, and uh, that's really good news. It's Capcom has kind of been down on its luck in the Resident Evil franchise over the last few years. Oh, and hopefully this is kind of a sign to let Capcom know which Resident Evil games people like. I mean, Resident Evil is Resident Evil. I don't like it when you try to turn Resident Evil into Call of Duty or Battlefield. You know, got guys, super buff dudes running up and punching boulders. I mean, that's not what Resident Evil was. Resident Evil was a very atmospheric adventure uh, slash uh, survival horror game. And uh, a lot of people now are re-experiencing re that. A lot of younger gamers who've never had a chance to play the fantastic GameCube Resident Evil remake are now able to play it on the PlayStation 4s and the Xbox One. And another little tidbit of information about this. This game also broke PlayStation Network records. It's the biggest selling day one digital title on PSN, which is amazing. Um, this uh, is a top selling PS3 and PS4 game in January as well, despite it being released uh, on the 20th of the month. And the game is only $20. Um, and, and to me, that's a really great value. Resident Evil, it takes time to beat it, it takes time to play it, it's a lot of details. Uh, to go through in this game that they changed the control scheme so you can play more traditional third-person controls and you can play the original tank control. I actually love this game. Uh, I haven't put in as much time on it as I would like. Playing Evolve, playing some other stuff, uh, getting ready to really delve into my Xbox One. Um, but Resident Evil definitely deserves the accolades. I want to know in the comments below what is your favorite Resident Evil game? Doesn't matter if it's handheld, doesn't matter if it's you know console, let me know your favorite. My favorite Resident Evil game of all time would have to be Resident Evil 4. Uh, probably followed by Resident Evil 2, then followed by Resident Evil Code Veronica, then Resident Evil 1. Those would be like my top four. Let me know in the comment section below. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. As always, thank you guys for the thumbs up and support. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.